We also see hundreds of homes at risk as the Red Apple Fire is burning more than 9,000 acres north of Wenatchee. It's only 10% contained. Our Amy Moreno was there all morning just outside Kashmir nearby. Well, fire crews worked through the night trying to do what they could with this fire. I want to give you a look at the hill behind me. As the sun came up this morning, some people coming out here just to take a look at the hillside and get a look at the situation. When we first arrived here before dawn, the fire had burned about two thirds, three quarters of this hillside. We watched it just continue to march down the hill, consuming the rest of that vegetation, moving fairly quickly. Just a testament to how dry the conditions are out here. We're feeling the wind pick up this morning. The Chelan County Sheriff's Office tells us they conducted a search warrant at a home yesterday, not too far from where we're at right now. They say that home is likely where the fire started. They haven't released many other details on that part of the investigation. Yesterday, they were able to use both air support and ground crews to try to get some headway on this fire. More than a thousand homes in the Wenatchee area are still dealing with some level of evacuation. Hundreds of other homes in the lower level one, two and three evacuation levels. Of course, those who live near the fire say, it's a stressful time. Oh, we were just watching from our back windows and we would see the flames come all around these houses and thought for sure that they were gone. So the firefighters have done an amazing job saving those houses. Well, air operations had to be suspended during the night. We expect those to resume today with the sun coming up. They should also get a boost today from a crew of type one firefighters who are going to arrive here. They are trained for these large fire situations involving homes that should give a boost to firefighters. They're also hoping to get some more resources. The wind is starting to pick up in the area. That's not great for this fire situation. Firefighters hoping to get a little bit of help as they're dealing with this wildfire. In Chelan County, Amy Marino, King 5 News. Thank you, Amy, and we're following that story throughout the day for you. A big buck passing right by our uh, photographer, Jim Scott, throughout their coverage this morning, and then several more deer trotting out of the, the brush with flames and smoke circling nearby. The Wenatchee Valley Humane Society is offering shelter to pets if their homeowners are under a level three evacuation notice. So we'll follow this as well as our Spokane affiliate to keep you covered throughout the day on TV and online as well.